This video is about incomplete dominance, might be thought of as blending. I don't believe Mendel ran across patterns of inheritance such as this because it might have been confusing to him. For this case, we'll use a type of flower called a snapdragon. We will cross a pure breeding red snapdragon with a pure breeding white snapdragon. So let's set up our Punnett square. We'll put the gametes of the red snapdragon across the top of the chart. And the gametes of the white snapdragon across the side. And to our surprise, the F1 generation are not red, but they are actually pink. So these are the F1s, and they're all pink. It almost looks like there's a blending between the red parent and the white parent. So, what's going on here? Is this really a case of blending between two forms of a gene? In order to understand incomplete dominance, we will create the next generation by crossing two of the F1s. So let's set up our Punnett square like this. They're each going to contribute a big R gamete, and they're each going to contribute a little r gamete. And lo and behold, the first F2 is big R, big R, which is red. Two of the F2s are big R, little r, which in this case is pink. And the final 25% are little r, little r, which is white. In conclusion, I describe the phenotypes over here. To understand what's going on, you need to know that the dominant allele produces red pigment. That's why Big R Big R is a red flower. And you also need to know that the recessive allele produces no pigment. It doesn't produce white. It's a mutant. It produces no pigment. So in a homozygous dominant plant, both alleles are producing pigment, as if you had two buckets of red paint in every cell. And in the heterozygous condition, only one of the alleles produces pigment. So it's like having one bucket of paint. This means there's not quite enough pigment to go around and the cell looks pink. So the flower looks pink. And finally, the homozygous recessive case, little r, little r, Mutant alleles don't produce any pigment, and the absence of pigment is white, and that's why little r, little r is a white flower. Well, I guess that's about it for incomplete dominance. Um, Mendel, as I mentioned, didn't really run across this pattern of inheritance. Had he it might have been confusing and so you know more than Mendel knows right